in the future, this truck will not need a driver. It will truly be autonomous. Today, our cars are equipped with advanced driver assistance systems that help us park, stay in lane on the freeway, or brake in emergencies, for example. Systems like these enhance safety and are made possible by a variety of sensors that monitor the vehicle's surroundings. When you think of these sensors, you're probably imagining loads of cameras. But Continental doesn't just rely on the car's eyes. It also uses radar and ultrasonic sensors. These utilize electromagnetic signals and waves to measure speed and distance, much like how bats use echoes for navigation. The laser sensors work in a similar way, using light pulses. The information collected by all of the sensors is sent to central control units, the brain, where it's processed to implement driving functions. Together with its partner Aurora, Continental is developing the autonomous trucking system of the future. But why? Demand for freight transportation is growing all the time. First, autonomous trucks reduce costs and delivery times for trucking companies and fleet operators. Second, they help solve the shortage of skilled workers, especially drivers. And third, they're good for the environment since they reduce fuel consumption. The project is currently in the testing phase. Thanks to Continental, autonomous trucking systems will go into production by 2027, starting in the USA. But what does an autonomous system like this actually involve? A whole array of sensors and lots of intelligence. But why? It's all about safety and reliability. Multiple redundant sensors work together to detect the vehicle environment. Backed by powerful computing, they make the truck intelligent, from the tires right through to the software. Continental is also developing the fallback system, a safety net that continues to steer the truck if necessary and brings it to a safe stop. Safety through redundancy. Continental is committed to system expertise to deliver the self-driving trucks of the future.